What's up guys, M here 25 here with a deck update of yes, finally, finally, a hero deck. You know, uh, I am named, uh, my name does stand for Masked Hero 25 because, you know, uh, I was really waiting for the Masked Hero deck to come out and so far I have not been impressed enough to run them. So anyway, here is my hero deck. Um, FYI, it is a little bit trashy in my opinion just because like, I am not running a lot of staple cards so what people may say just simply because this is a deck I just made with extra stuff on the side like there's no solemns or anything, no bottom misses, uh, only a few staple cards that either I A don't run in other decks, B have spares of, or C just you know don't feel like I should run in any other decks. But yeah, without further ado here is my hero deck. Uh, for, uh, let's go. So first off, two T Kings, uh, three Alias, one Stratos, one Honest, Deeps, two D Speed Divas, um, one Reese the Ice Mistress, one Jinzo, one Ice Edge, and one Avocator Chevalier, and then one Crusader of Edamin or Edim or I don't know Spellcaster dude, whatever. Uh, spells, which this deck is very heavy in, uh, Rota. Mind Control, Dark Hole, Future Fusion, Monster Born, Instant Fusion, uh, Parallel World Fusion, Polymerization, you gotta have the old school card in there, uh, two MSTs, two, two Super Polys, two, uh, three G-Sparks, and three E-Calls, and then uh, finally three Miracle Fusions. Uh, onto the traps, I only run six, uh, three Hero Blasts, two Call, and one Mirror Force. Um, Pretty much the reasons why you run certain cards in this deck is simple. Um, uh, Thunder Kings, uh, that may be sketchy, but it, I pretty much based this deck off two people I know of, uh, I know of versus Waffle One, uh, Waffle One Two Three. I saw his uh, Light Hero deck, I really liked it, so I took a lot of that incorporation and put it into my deck. Also, I took another tweak from my friend uh, Flip Agent Double O Seven. Um, I liked what he did with the deck. I am mix I'm missing a few of his cards, but I really didn't want to use them anyway. Like there were maxis and veilers. You know, I don't really use those cards and you know, they're not really my thing. But yeah. Um let's see. Uh the Divas and the I Reese is pretty much you know, I'll, uh if I summon Deep Sea Diva, um I can I could sink her, but I really don't do that in this deck. I mostly exceed, so I run two divas and a Reese just because like if I, I I've been I I've drawn into two divas before, and you know I can't uh, use the effect special summon, uh, so I rather have a Reese in the deck or another diva in the deck, and then you know I can always get to Gachi Gachi to you know boost all my monsters up. It's really good. Uh, Jinzo, I'm I thought ahead for this card, like you know like okay. Let's put this card in the deck for now, cause when Squardio comes out, I need a dark target in this deck, cause I'm not. It's not always gonna be 100%. I'm gonna be doing an Insector deck, uh, or some Dark World deck. I need to have so I need to have another way out. So Jinzo is in there. Also, you know, I like a little loophole when if you use Jinzo to, and call the Haunted Jinzo, and you can destroy call the Haunted Jinzo still stays in the field because it negates all the traps. So that's uh, that's a pretty good way to get Jinzo out fast without sacrificing. Um, Chevalier, a fire target for, uh, you know, Nova Master, and it's another target for G-Spark, same thing with Crusader, another target for G-Spark, and it's another target for, um, uh, Shining. Uh, Instant Fusion, I run in here for, you know, um, my, some few launchers I use to overlay to level 3's fast, or, and also, you know, it gives me bait to, you know, uh, um, uh, either Poly or Super Poly or Miracle Fusion into to get some launchers out fast. Uh, polymerization I run simply because that card is old school and, and it's good for it, it was it, it was made for a reason and it still holds up because Miracle Fusion you need to have either on the field or in the grave sometimes you just don't even want to summon something because you know they're going to negate it or they may have something that you don't like or sometimes you want to really push and sometimes you know you run out of mir like and sometimes you only have like a miracle in your hand so I rather do poly miracle then parallel world fusion that's three fusions in one turn and let's say I, it's Nova Masters, one of them, I topping the Super Poly, uh, somehow summon another monster, Super Poly with theirs, and it's pretty much GG at that point. It's just like four monsters, and they're going to be at least over 2,000, and you're going to have a hard time getting over all of them. So, yeah, um, Super Poly, self-explanatory, um, let's see, Hero Blast, um, the only target here is Alias, everything else is kind of, eh, but you know, it's been a good card so far, I run this card in three, just because... 
it's been a really good bluff and also been really useful when I need to like I've used it against in the sectors, use it against wind ups, use it against um uh rabbits and it's been come out pretty well. I even used it against an evil sword deck today and it wrecked him. It wrecked. So yeah. Um extra deck wise the two fusion monsters, a fusionist and a Drake uh Dragonist. Uh, basics of uh, fusions, Ab Zero, Shinings, One Great Tornado, Nova Master, Gaia, uh, Trinity's back there, right there, and then Adoration, and then, you know, Exceeds, Gachi, Gachi, Gem Knight, Number 17, Leviathan Dragon, then Number 39. Um, the reason I chose Fusionist and Dragoness is simply because I don't have another, I don't have any Earth targets in this deck, and... Uh, or I only have one air, so I'd rather use Dragon Ness than Elemental Hero Stratos to fuse with. Because if I used like Miracle, I do not want to. I I don't want to use Stratos unless I know I'm getting Shining, or or a parallel parallel on my hand. So I'd rather use use that. So yeah. Also the level three, so I can uh, overlay with Ice Edge to you know get a rank three out. And this only uh, and he's my only rank three in there. So yeah, that's pretty much my deck. Um, any questions, comments, concerns, please leave them down below in the comment section. Um, uh, like if you like the video, dislike if you think the lighting sucks, or if you think my deck sucks, etc, etc. You know, um, just go ahead and do whatever, because you came to the video, you watched it, it's up to you, and you know, if you didn't like it, it's all good, if you did, awesome. But alright guys, it's M here at 25, signing out, peace out.